In my last video, I built this 3D printed nerf gun. And yeah, it works. But it's kind of bad. It can only shoot one shot at a time and takes hours to reload. But no problem is too big for a guy who owns a 3D printer. At least that's what I'm trying to tell myself every day. But let's build a magazine. So I started by 3D printing out all of these parts. And uh, let's look at these. These are rails, which the magazine will be slided into. They can be attached to the gun's main body using only one screw. And now I might understand that this is a bit too small of an attachment, but it's fine. Look at it. It's, it's looking good. All right. I then had to assemble the magazine, which took a while. There were a lot of screws to screw down, so this is a sped up compilation of me attaching some screws. Enjoy! Wow, I'm really good at screwing. But the, the magazine <laughs> attaches pretty badly because of the armrest. So let's fix that. This old rusty saw which I found laying in a ditch probably will do the thing. So look at this! After removing some material, it works much better and the magazine actually can slide in and slide out perfectly. Yeah. But I also printed out a bigger magazine, which can hold 7 darts instead of the 3 darts which the smaller can hold. Which is a, quite a big uh, of an improvement. Look at all those darts. I thought about making an even bigger magazine, which could hold 15 darts or something, but it would take 10 hours, so... I couldn't do it, guys. I'm sorry. 10 hours is too long. So, I think it's time to try out this gun. In the very professional shooting range of my bedroom, in the corner. Yeah, as you can see, I'm, I'm shaking the gun. And you might wonder, Roboter, why are you shaking the gun? Well, you have to make the dart fall into the chamber. So, <laughs> yeah, it's bad. It's really bad. It kind of got a 50% success rate. But we take those on the Roboter channel. 50% is, is fine. And it, it shot all darts, which I see as a success. And yeah, it might not be the best looking guy, gun. It might not be the best functioning nerf gun, but I built it myself, and I really like it. So subscribe to not miss my other projects. They will hopefully be better. See you later.